Okay, we solve another problem in isometric that is problem number 18 in CAD solution book. Here, in the rectangular pyramid of dimension 40 into 25. Okay, 40 into 25 we have to construct height of 50 is placed centrally on a cylindrical slab of diameter 100. Okay, first we have to construct a cylindrical slab of diameter 100. Above it, we have to place a rectangular pyramid. Okay, so first we have to construct a boxes here box of 100 okay mm, thickness also given 30 okay. Okay, from this reference point 100 means 10 box 1 So from this one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. So first we're going to construct a box of ten here. So cylindrical slab means uh, it is a circular and here we have the diameter given so that means so mark the middle point we have to go by 4 rp center method So it is done. Now we have to consider a vertical height thickness 30. 1, 2, 3. Just mark the point, don't draw vertical line. Just you have to mark the point 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Here again, you can construct another box. box of 100 by 100 it is it is 10 by 10 again mark the middle points exactly middle point means 5 boxes here Correct. 
and here it is very important okay. so it is done now we see here so diagonal lines because it is in cylinder so we have to draw the diagonals here So now we carefully see it we have to connect these points okay vertically we have to join so this completes the cylinder so above it we have to construct a rectangle or a pyramid of dimension 40 40 into 25 so 40 into 25 so we can place 40 here or here so we have to do so say 100 minus 40 means it is 60 divided by two sides means 30 so so on this top side i'm going to mark 30 here 30 30 and from this side also 30 and 30 okay so 30 30 is marked so you can draw line here Again now 100 minus 25. So 100 is, uh, it is 75. 75 divided by 2 means it is uh, it is uh, how much 30 37.5. So we have to mark here this side 37.5, 35, 37.5. Approximately we can mark. 37.5 from this end also mm, 37.5 so from this end 30 37.5 okay so now here you can see this is our rectangle we want to make it dark And see that we have to sorry we have to have here this this is a rectangle this is 40 40 by 25 this one by 25 so this is our rectangle okay so so i'm making it as dark okay 40 by see see there's what 10 20 30 40 this 25 20 20 2 2 here 25 so here now uh, by taking the center so, so by taking the center so it will draw an axis length here. So from this center point, we have to consider a height height of 50 here from this end. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So height of 50, we have to do. Now we have to join it. can see that this uh, rectangular prism is done so it's completed so today we are going to do this uh, problem in solid aid software it is a rectangular pyramid of dimension 14 to 25 and height 50 place center in a cylindrical slab of diameter 100 and thickness 30 so first we are going to construct a cylindrical slab here okay So here is cylindrical slab of uh, diameter 100 means a box of 100 we need to create. Okay. So 100, 30 angle again 100, angle 150 again 100, angle 210 degree. So then finally join here. Now for our boy center method to construct the ellipse here. So from the center to the 
middle point and came from the center to the middle point and came from this corner to the middle point came from this corner to the middle point now we have to go for the half by center take thickness 0.10 so from this point consider this length again from here to here insert second arc again from this length Now <clears throat> there is another ellipse you have to consider at a height of 30. So for that, first I will take uh, draw an uh, straight line right center. So from this end, I will be considering a uh, height here. Okay, height of uh, this center point height of 30 okay. then after this I'm going to select it so I'm going to create a copy of it And I'm going to move with respect to this center point. Here, okay, unselect a copy. Okay. So, we have saved one. Now, I'm going to delete this. So, so vertically downward, we have to connect these ends. Is it done? So now we have to uh, draw this rectangle. Okay. So the rectangle it is having dimension 40 by 25. So 40 by 25. So 40 means uh, at 30 we have to cut arc. Okay. Uh, I will draw a line only here. Okay, from this end, I'll take uh, 30. Okay, from this end, line. Okay, here also I'll draw another line of 30 here. From this end also, 30. Okay, from this end also. In line here, connecting this. Okay. Another we have 25, 100 minus 25 means it is 75. 75 minus uh, 75 divided by 2 means it is 37.5. So, here yeah, from this end, 37.5. Online. Again, from this end also, thirty. Okay. Yeah, from this end also, seven point five. Again, from this end also, seven point five. Okay. So now we can draw thin lines. So now you can see here we have the rectangle here. So I'm going to make, make that uh, dark. So this is our uh, rectangle. So from this rectangle, 
consider the center of the box here. Okay, from this point. So what is the axis set here? We have 50. So from this end, we are considering a axis of height 50. Okay. So now we can join. the problem so the extra lines we have drawn so we are going to remove it so this completes the problem so we can show the angle here thirty degree thirty degree so now we have to convert this into ISO Zero point eight six meters. 